guys my name is Tinashe and welcome back to my channel so today we have a chit chat and actually <laughs> this is not even planned at all it's not planned at all at all at all um this is just the beginning of the year and i was watching something and then i really got slightly emotional as i was watching that and i was like in the state that i'm in let me film something because it might help someone somewhere out there who might be going through something similar um yeah so it's the beginning of the year and you know people are very happy oh beginning of the year um vision board manifestation this is what i'm going to do new year new me bigger better you know all those things and for me this particular year this 2022 that is not where my mind is at right um for some people who might not know i i i'm a christian um so i was just like lord god all i want is for you to sustain me to keep me to ground me mold me and to be my cornerstone i was having a discussion with my husband the other day as to okay so what are your resolutions etc and in my head i'm like i i don't have like actually don't have i just want I just want God to just do those those things. I just have like a board and then I'll try it all the things like I, I wanted for the year. Um looking at say budget, looking at this, looking at that. Um have like five things that I really really want, um things that I'm working towards. this year i'm just like look god i just want to survive <laughs> i just want to survive uh this year and for him to continue molding me you know i was looking through like instagram and people are taking stock of their year for 2022 right and And in my mind, I'm like, I'm honestly glad that I survived. I feel like the past few years have been really tough. They've been really tough on most people, me included. So moving from point A to point B for me has been... has been a, um, how do I put it, a welcome event, right? Um, what I am sure of this year for myself is my word. My word for the year is building. That's the only thing that I'm sure of. The rest, I'm like, God, God. Just, just just work your way in my life because I just need to survive like I really just need to survive you know when you look at maybe say some of the things that you're working towards um, for me anyway 
some of the things that you're working towards. Um, you know, your crows, ETC, what your mind has been able to do and what it has not been able to do. Things that you need to change, but you, you probably just could not change. Some goals that you had in mind and nothing has really happened. I, I'm just like, you know, Lord God, you see me. You see your child. You've always been seeing me through. Whatever it is that needs fixing, fix it. Right? And I'm very sure I'm not the only one who is maybe going through this it's the beginning of the year and you know so I was just like you know what let me let me document this sometimes sometimes people might not know that they're going through something right or you think you're going through something and you're not you're just not in a good space or you, you are okay. Where you are, you are very much okay. So, I'm like, you know what? Let me document this. It might not be for, let me document this for me, actually. And probably I'll do this every year. just to document the beginning of the year and how I'm feeling, you know, just being in touch with how you are feeling. You know the times whereby you start having, like say doubts with some of the things that you're working towards, because you're not seeing much traction. Very good example, my YouTube channel, right? You're not seeing much traction create a video nothing much is happening it's only today when I was having those thoughts that I was just like but Tanaji who are you creating this content for right and for me the reason why, the reason why I do what I do it's because I, I, I um, as a child I've always been creative right if I was taught something, I, I, I would, I would catch on, and I'm able to do it. Stuff like you know, like art. I, I, I think I come from part of my family is very good at my good with their hands, very artistic. So that aspect has always been, has always been. Um, an outlet of sorts for me. So I remember there's a time when you were asked to draw at school. And I have uh, my aunt and my uncle who can really, really draw. And I remember I drew something and I'm like, huh? Actually, I didn't know I could draw at that point anyway. And I remember when I drew that thing, people were like, oh wow, you can actually draw. I used to have like a batch of stickers, right? I used to have like a batch of stickers and um, I used to collect stamps, stickers. I think I have hoarder tendencies. <laughs> I think I have hoarder tendencies. I hold on to, um, on to, um, to things so even as a child I would you know collect things um, make things etc so so I think I have always been a creative and you know with adulthood you forget such aspects about yourself because um, <laughs> life you know 
adulting life. So, so the reason why I personally started this channel was it was actually just my outlet, just a small space um, whereby I can I can teach. At some point, like earlier on in my life, uh, when I was a bit younger, that's something that I ultimately wanted to do. Not teach in a school per se, but impart something. It's like impart something into the world. I, I don't know whether it, it, it makes sense, right? So... So that, right? Um, that's why I think when I come to you guys, you, you don't see a lot of fluff. <laughs> I come to you in my habitant. I, um, I, you know, like I, I, um, th there's no fluff here. Um, not saying that I, 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 I can't do it, but I just won't. That's not what I want to do. I want uh, I want like say my YouTube channel to be a channel where I am I'm doing things more for me, right? I want a situation whereby I feel like something is a chore to do and then I end up not doing it. Like, oh yeah, oh my gosh, now I have to put on makeup. Oh my gosh, now I have to put on a wig. Oh my gosh, now yeah, and then it's that thing of also just embracing yourself for who you are you know actually i actually go out of the house like this and there's nothing wrong with this this is just your hair that has been put in cornrows and this should be enough it should suffice there's someone from work who i saw and they're like oh tinashe you look different it's it's the hair right and they're trying to communicate something obviously but in my mind I'm like the more I you should be in a space where you are doing things because you want to do them in, 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 in that element of not wanting to fit in and it's okay for you not to fit in I just look at say my life and fitting in has never been something that has how do I put it fitting in has always been difficult for me um, I, I think I've always been different I've always valued different things my perspective is is different um, and sometimes when you are communicating yourself it can be a little bit um, off to someone if you're not packaged in a certain way, right? So that's something that I've always been used to. So when I was just self-reflecting, I was like, okay, number one, continue doing things for you, right? Number two, your outlet is your outlet. Let that be the pivot of whatever it is that you are uh, doing. Uh, number three, be in touch with with you. Be in touch with um, with the way you act. It's 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 always good to to touch base with yourself mentally. Uh, a lot of people have been going through a lot of things because of mental health, or you hear that also and so has has gotten a stroke and you're thinking oh my gosh that person was a young person what happened to them or oh yeah so and so has um it's it's not okay mentally etc and you're just like but what's wrong and sometimes you look at their life maybe they have money they have this they have that and so you're thinking so what are they lacking you know them to be in that situation but i think it's because sometimes we don't 
we don't touch base with our um, with ourselves with our inner beings we try too much to please other people we try too much to fit in um, we 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 try so hard to be accepted and to be relevant and we forget the most important thing which is actually you and your being and are you okay you know if if this has helped you say something in the comment section below if you're going through something similar say something in the comment section below if you're going through you know a moment of reflection etc yeah say 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 something in the comment section below but do not move away from your true self and from your essence and from what makes you you which is a beautiful beautiful thing yeah so thank you so much for listening i'm actually seeing this video is now 17 minutes long but um, i'm actually going to post it because that is where i'm at as of the beginning of the year and i'll just do the same video next year and then then we'll see so guys thank you so much for watching i really do appreciate your time hang in there um don't let what everyone else has accomplished and what everyone else is doing move you hang in there you're living just this one life your life by yourself and do things that make you whole thank you bye